Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. Back in June of this year, I posted letting you know that Edge's Copilot mode, the new tab page, was getting an AI-powered newsfeed, and I asked the question, bloat or not? And that was back in Edge Canary 139, an early preview version, where Microsoft would be adding a newsfeed to its Copilot AI version of the new tab page. And this is also known as Copilot Discover. Now, back when Microsoft first started testing this feature, there were no settings available to control what appeared in the feed. Now, just to let you know that that seems like it's all set to change because in Edge Canary, Microsoft is now adding Copilot Discover feed settings, which is available behind an experimental flag. So if you are testing features, you can just head to your address bar, enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags into the address bar, hit enter. That opens up the experimental flags page and all you need to do is just enter discover. And here's the new flag. Copilot Discover Integration Settings enables the Copilot Discover feed settings in the Unified Compose new tab page. Just change it from default to enabled. Now, just on a side note, because there's kind of two parts to this video. And if you want to enable this Copilot Newsfeed Discover feed in the stable version of Microsoft Edge, the flag to do so CM feature Copilot Discover integration is available as well in the stable. And all you would do is change it from default to enabled or any one of the other options here. Full feed experience or peak feed experience, I'll just keep it enabled. I don't see too much difference in the different settings. But nonetheless, if you want to enable the Discover feed on the Copilot new tab page, Go check for this flag in the stable version. Follow the steps that I showed you in this video and you'll be able to enable the Copilot Discover feed in the stable version. The only difference is this flag for the settings is not available. So just wanted to put it out there in case you're unaware or would like to do that. Now with that all out the way, with this flag enabled, and obviously in Canary you have to have this flag enabled to get this to work, the settings. You would restart your browser and then head back, click on the gear icon, and here you'll see feed settings. In the stable, once you've enabled that flag, you'll only see show feed. But in Canary, you'll see feed settings, click on personalize, and here we have a couple of different options. First of all, you've got, so here you've got your channels where you can pick channels for a more so-called personalized stream and discover feed. If you are following any, you can have your list of followed channels. Blocked, the same applies. You'll see a list here. Top of feed, info cards. You can choose what is displayed at the top of your feed to some degree or the other. Those would be these little info cards here, like little widgets almost. Heading back into those feed settings. If you've saved any content, it'll appear here. And you've also got your region and location. And I've just changed this to United States because when I have it at my default region, this feed does not appear in Canary, although it works fine in this table. So it could be a bug in Canary. Now, just on another side note, personally, I don't think this is a feature I would use, but everybody's needs are different. And preferences are different so just making you guys aware that this is available in the stable follow the steps as mentioned if you want to enable it in stable and in canary you get the feed now plus those feed settings which i think is great because it does give you a bit of options and i'm always open to options 
So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.